This is part 27 of AngularJS tutorial. In this video, we'll discuss how to remove hash from URLs. This is continuation to part 26, so please watch part 26 before proceeding. Notice within the URL, we have the hash symbol. No matter to which page you go to, we have a hash symbol in the URL. To remove this hash symbol, there are four simple steps. The first step is to enable HTML5 mode routing. To enable HTML5 mode routing, we are going to inject $LocationProviderService into the config function. So let's flip to Visual Studio. Within our script.js file, we have our config function right here. At the moment, we are injecting $RouteProvider. Let's also inject $LocationProvider. And then we are going to use HTML5 mode function and then pass it true to enable HTML5 mode routing. That's the first step. The second step is to remove hash symbol from all the links in index.html. So let's go to index.html. Notice within every link we have got hash forward slash. We can get rid of those two symbols now because we are making use of HTML5 mode routing. That's our second step. The third step is to include this URL rewrite rule in web.config file. Now basically this rewrite rule is telling that any request for a URL should be rewritten to index.html. However, there are some exceptions, there are some conditions. And the conditions are if the request is for a file or for a directory or if it's a web API request, then we don't want this rule to be processing that request. All the other requests should be mapped to index.html, which is our layout page. Into that layout page, all the other partial templates will be injected. So that's the reason why we are redirecting every request to index.html. So let's include this rewrite rule in web.config file. In the interest of time, I have already typed the required configuration. So let's copy it from the notepad and paste it within our web.config file. That's our third step. Last and the final step is to set this base href element to the location of your single page application. And this should go within the layout page. So in our index.html, I am going to include base href element. And I'm going to set this to forward slash. So basically what this is telling is that the layout view, which is the page, into which all the other partial templates will be injected is present within the root directory of our application. So at the moment index.html, this is present in the root directory. That's why we have set base href to a forward slash in case if that index.html is present in a different folder, maybe something like my app, then your href will be my app. In our case, it's present in the root directory. So we have just included a forward slash there. So those are the four steps that are required to remove that hash symbol from the URL. So with all these changes, let's rerun the page. And look at this. When I type, for example, slash home, look at that. We are on the home page. Similarly, when we go to courses, we are on the courses page. And slash students takes us to students page. Now we have clean URLs. So these are the four simple steps to require to remove that hash from URL in Angular. Thank you for listening and have a great day.